Now, experts in various fields are on Korea's southern resort island of Jeju for a very special gathering. The big names are there to discuss ways to achieve peace and prosperity throughout the continent of Asia. The theme of this year's Jeju Forum is sharing a common vision of Asia's future. Our Connie Kim is there and filed this report. It's a small resort island off the southern coast of the Korean Peninsula. But around this time of the year, thousands of scholars from around the world and several former heads of states gather here in Jeju. This year's event is all the more important in these uncertain times domestically and globally. The opening ceremony kicked off with South Korean President Moon Jae-in describing the peaceful Korean peninsula he envisions. <laughs> Security issues are among the many topics being addressed at the three-day event, with former U.S. Vice President Al Gore, who served in the Clinton administration, highlighting the wide range of discussions that he says needs to happen. This forum has become over the years a truly exemplary gathering for a multilateral dialogue on peace and prosperity with a focus on diplomacy and its task in providing a space for international collaboration throughout East Asia and Asia on foreign policy issues uh, and environmental issues, security issues and economic issues. As part of that, former leaders from Indonesia, Portugal and Mongolia share their thoughts on building prosperity, calling for cooperation from outside of Asia. The North Korea nuclear question cannot be solved without the coordination between the United States and China. In this context, it is my firm belief that in this cooperation between East Asia countries and the European Union, may contribute to security and prosperity in the region. The forum's organizing committee hopes the event can serve as a platform for global peace, where the visions and issues of the future can be shared and addressed together. Connie Kim, Arirang News, Jeju.